Hey, hello everybody and welcome back to Crash Couch. Uh, my name is HR and I thought we would uh, take a little break from all the Spider-Man and hop back into some more uh, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure All-Star Battle R. I've already gotten the plat for the game, but I thought I would just play some more online because I'm having a lot more fun with this than I ever thought I would. So I thought we would just, you know, probably make this an annual thing where on Fridays I play like various like fighting games. And uh, I'm working tonight, so I'm working this whole weekend actually, so I won't be able to stream again until Monday. So I thought I would try and get some more uh, content for you guys to make sure that you have something to tide you over until I can come back. playing as Gyro for a little bit. And with uh, Jothro as our assist. Okay, so we're going up against Rohan. With Yoshikage Kira as the assist. Should be interesting. I guess Go Sock would be more specific. But no, this game is amazing, and I would highly recommend it. I was just checking out a uh, Cell Kitten. I was hanging out over on her stream. So if you want to give her a follow, I'm sure she would uh, greatly appreciate that. Just go ahead and tell her I sent you. He's kinda getting a bit quiet for me, I wonder why. I need to check to make sure my mic is fully plugged in. how they're gonna explain like the steel balls for part 7 because I know it's supposed to be like the counterpart to Hamon and I can't remember it, and I looked it up a while ago I just can't remember exactly like how they're supposed to be healing people because I know like they use this technique primarily as like doctors but also like executioners <laughs> Well, I guess I kind of... I saw that coming because I've never really played as Gyro before. There's a little bit of lag, but hopefully we can get past that. Managed to hit him off with the... Uh, Regular heat attack, hopefully we can keep the momentum going. Okay, it looks like spin spin is an empty error, so probably need to avoid. Oh Surprised I was able to pull that off in time. Usually Why does he why does he have me knock him up in the air if he's just gonna continue standing on the ground in the regular heat attack? Uh huh. I'm surprised he wasn't able to hit me with that. I don't even remember what the performance parts are supposed to be doing right now. 
But no, I was just talking about uh, how I was thinking about making this like a regular thing where on Fridays I play like various like fighting games to try and get a break from like all the like action kind of like RPG games I've been playing because I've been going through the uh, Spider-Man games. I just beat the first one recently. And uh, I started going through Miles Morales yesterday. Managed to get about almost like three hours in. So that's a pretty good stream. And I was just hanging out over at uh, Cell Kitten's uh, channel. She's going through like a Pokemon like Sword and Shield right now. She's doing like regular playthrough. She's a new friend of mine, so if you guys want to go ahead and check her out, I'm pretty sure she'd be appreciated. Or appreciative. I can't English, so. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Man, this match is going up a lot closer than I was expecting. Either this guy's really good with Rohan, or I am just that bad when it comes to Gyro. Hopefully, nope. I probably should have seen that coming that I would not be able to pull that off. If I remember correctly, his horse is named Valkyrie, which is always a nice reference because I do enjoy Norse mythology. It's been a while since I read the Poetica Etica, or Poet... I think it's Poetica Etica? I can't exactly remember. Uh, yeah, choose my character, because... I am not all that good with Gyro. Let's try a funny Valentine instead. And let's go with, uh... Part 4 Jotaro is the assist. Oh shit, we're going double Kira. Okay, that's interesting. He's going with the Yoshikage and the Kosaku backup. That's pretty cool. God, Killer Queen is just so fucking cool. I love him, man. Yeah, I guess so. Filthy axe at a reasonable price. I know if I can... I know with a funny Valentine, if I can get all three of the corpse parts, I can eventually get up to a D4C Love Train. But no, I don't really want to... Okay, managed to get him in a bit of a combo there. Pretty nice. Fuck! Man, he managed to knock both corpse parts out of me. I have no idea where the third one is. So I don't really think I'm gonna get to it anytime soon, but in the meantime, I'm just gonna. Fuck! I was gonna try and hit him with like, my great D, but I don't think that's gonna be happening anytime soon. I think he may have gotten me on this. Yeah, he definitely got me on this round. I'm gonna try and get him again on the next one. He's so calm, but then again, I guess he usually is. It doesn't matter that he got the first attack, so long as I can get some momentum and just keep it going. Oh, 
total throw on 973. Oh wait, you can't block against that. Fuck! I, I forgot that's one of the ones that you can't block against. Holy shit! That does so much damage! Fucking Christ! Hopefully this manages to level the playing field somewhere. But I do not think at all, guys, that I'm gonna win this one. Unless this is like a... Nope. Nope, this is not a one-hit kill. Nope. Well played. Well played, GG. Gonna do one more round with him and then uh gonna move on to another opponent. Or maybe uh, actually you know what, let's make it an even four. We'll do two more rounds. And then we'll move on. Okay, so he's so he's switching up to Josuke then, huh? Josuke with part three Jotaro as the assist. Fucking love Crazy Diamond, man. Surprisingly, it makes purple look bad or pink look badass. Like, if it weren't for JoJo, it probably would not. Like, any stand, or I guess any ability that would be pink, probably would not look as good if it weren't for JoJo. Because Crazy Diamond looks badass. And, uh. It's probably, like, one of my all time, like, favorite hero stands. So Platinum, the world of God! Oh, I didn't think it would do anything since I was already below, like, one, but I guess it doesn't really matter so long as you still have some. Huh, you're not even trying to hit me with a... You're not even trying to hit me with your ult? I respect that. So now let me go ahead and knock it out of you, so I'm so you can't get it with your ult. Got him with a right hook across the face. So doing pretty good so far. I, I guess I'm basic because I seem to be pretty low with Jojo. Not so much with like the more tricky characters, kind of like Funny Valentine or Yoshikake. Oh, fuck me. I can't even remember if that does like a damage buff or anything, but whatever it is, it can't exactly be all that good for me. I think it is a damage buff, but I can't remember. I need to look that up later. Or if it's like a, he takes less damage. Because I could have sworn I had him in like in the middle of a combo right there. It didn't seem to be hitting him all that much. Oh boy, lag. Got some lag going on there. So Platinum! The world! You kicked me off! Alright, and I managed to level the playing field some more. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Ah, oh, fuck me, he got me. Well played. Well played. Man, it looked like he just impaled me right then and there. Joe's kid is a pretty good JoJo, like he definitely belongs here. Despite part 4 being amongst my least favorite parts, because of the more spice of life elements, I still 
still enjoyed it. And Josuke is like, he's a, he's a really good one. I do like him a lot. So I guess I'm a basic bitch and my favorite is uh, Jotaro. Fuck! I was going to try and get the block in. Because he hit me with a throw. Can it be Jotaro? He's as good as me or better? No, that was Jotaro, buddy. That looks like, uh, looks like he was done for the day. So let's go ahead and find our next matchup real quick. Hope you guys are doing pretty good. I'm doing alright so far. Almost the end of my day off, so sadly that means I'm gonna have to go back to work soon. Currently working at a uh, county jail right now. Not too bad for the most part. Uh, it has its moments, sure, where some days it's like frantic as all get out, and then other times it's boring as shit, but to be honest, I'd rather take the boring days over the exciting days. Because working at a jail is a lot more different than it is at like any other job. It can be pretty scary at times. But, uh, currently working at the jail and planning on moving on up to uh, a casino uh, that some of my friends are working at. Let's try out uh, Yoshikage. And for, uh, We'll go TV as our assist. And, uh, I'm thinking about like, going to work at a casino that my buddy's working at. And then that way it should be a lot easier making content. Because then we don't have to exactly plan around our schedules as heavily as we do down here. We can just walk across the house and just be like, hey, you want to go do this? Alright, let's get started. Who exactly do you think you're talking to? Just get here, Kashikara. I think that's the Abdul's father skin. Which I remember, I think I got because I uh, pre ordered the game. Which I mean, of course I did with that much of a JoJo fan I am. This, uh, this game is just amazing. I never get tired of playing this game. After going through like the story mode and having a blast playing like the online matches. Psychic Pickle, oh my god. That sounds like something from Rick and Morty. I'm a Psychic Pickle, Morty! Yeah. I guess I'm not as bad with Kira as I originally thought I was. I'm kind of surprised though that Teal is like out of all the main villains of JoJo. Like he's literally the only one that has a battle cry. He has both Yuri and Muda Muda, which not a lot of the other, like none of the other villains really have. I mean, sure, they have, like, cash raises when they activate their powers, but it's not exactly like you hear Yoshikaka Kira screaming anything. Fuck! 
Okay, that's not good. That's not good. Nah. Peter Creed! Dear Hot Detector! Wait, what? You can avoid that one? Huh? I had no idea you could avoid that ult at all. That's why I didn't even block it last time earlier. Like, I thought you were stuck with it. Well, I guess that means I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> Damn. Nice, nice one, Psychic Pickle. Come on, Iggy, bail me out. Thanks, Iggy. You're like the best dog in JoJo. You're the only one that actually ever really fought. Yeah, I just... Have you ever noticed that? How in, like, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, like... None of the dogs that have ever shown up have lived like a long, happy life. I think the only one in the part so far that has actually lived is, uh, excuse me, Koichi's dog, Police. But it's like, no, Danny got, Danny got like set on fire. Iggy, Iggy had like his ribs crushed into his organs and like went out. And then there were the, and then there was the one in part four that killed, got killed by like Aqua Necklace's user, Angelo. Come on, I want to. Come on, I almost got it. I almost got it. Ah. I remember trying to play as Kida before and it never really worked out for me. I guess I just overestimated him. Or I guess underestimated. Fuck it! I can't English. But evidently I guess I'm not as bad. Use Yoshikage Kiran. Huh. I wasn't even paying attention to the online missions, but evidently <laughs> online ID. Psychic Pickle, Send. I really love that name, so let's go ahead and do another matchup real quick. Let's see how I am with uh, Kosaku. And let's bring in Part 4 Jokura's backup. Considering they bothered to place him in the game, I imagine he must play a bit, if not a lot differently than Yoshikage. Because otherwise, why add him, you know? Huh. Looks like he's having trouble deciding on who he wants to play as. Ah, oh, thanks, Psychic Pickle. Or I guess he was just responding to me, so... I mean, I'll take it. Y'all help with weekly? Uh, I don't think I can respond right now. Because we're in the middle of a matchup, so... I'm, I'm probably... if I... I don't know. I can't stay up for much longer. Because I, I gotta go to bed for work, but... I guess I can probably help him out somewhat. Or as much as I can in the time they got. Peter Green! Green! Dyson Bakudan! Fight the dust I cannot believe that it actually worked. I did not think that it was gonna work at all. Oh, weed sandwich! Thank you for the follow, man. Hope you're having fun. Like this is easily one of my favorite games back when it came out on like a PS4 or no or PS3. So when I heard that like, this is getting a remake, you 
Oh, you had no idea how happy I was. Like, I pre-ordered it immediately. And, oh man. This game is just so amazing. And this is definitely a game by for, like, JoJo fans. I don't know if the guys at CyberConnect are JoJo fans, but based on the amount of, like, time and effort they put into this game, I would definitely say that there's a bunch of them behind the, the behind the closed doors. I wonder what his throw is. Oh, so he grabs you by the neck. Okay, that's neat. But no, like, I was, uh, surprised I was able to pull that off again. Huh. I remember having a I remember having a lot of trouble usually playing as Kosaku. And then again, it's been a long time since I played this on PS4, so who knows? Maybe I've actually gotten better at fighting games. Or more than likely I'm just buying it in my own height. To be fair, I can see either one happening. This is probably not gonna work. Damn. Man, this is... You really have to set that one... You have to plan that one up ahead of time. Because there's no way in hell you're gonna be able to just... Straight up and like, get them most of the time. Oh, neat! So you can use that barrier to like block your opponent from escaping. Oh, well played. Well played, Psychic Pickle. Well played. Need to try and, uh... Use my assist better. Again, I do wish that this game was a 2v2, like, team, tag team, instead of just, like, an assist. But I'm, I don't really mean that as in like a negative thing against the game itself. It's just more like something I wish they would take into consideration for the next one, you know? Because based on the fact that this had enough interest alone to get a remake, I have no doubt in my mind that they're going to make like a second one. And who knows, they might even do like an original story for it. I I'll, I did play like the late one of the latest JoJo games, like Eyes of Heaven. And Eyes of Heaven had like its own original story mode, which I would totally love for a sequel to that game set in that new universe. And also like I would uh like if All Star Battle were to come out with another game, whether it's unique story mode, I would totally I would buy that. I would absolutely 100% buy that, no questions asked. Like, just already go ahead and take my money. I wonder exactly how strong Killer Queen is. Because Crazy Diamond, I think, is on like the same level as like Star Platinum. So that kind of makes me just think that he's on that same level as well. But then again, can't exactly know for sure. Uh, let's see here. Let's choose character to have a rematch. like talk to you later I have honestly have no idea
guys like better, Haman or Stan? Personally, I like them both, but it just makes me wonder sometimes, like, what would happen if you could combine, like, Haman, like, with Stan? Because you can imagine, like, Haman, like, Yukako, like, since her Stan is bound to her hair, can you imagine what it would be like if she was able to use Haman and how much, like, more dangerous she would be? Like, that would be kind of something I would totally be down to watch, really. Like, to see stand users being able to use, like, Hamon with their, like, stand abilities. Like, Star Platinum. Yeah, just see, like, how dangerous she is with her hair regularly. I can only imagine what it would be like. Kind of surprised I was able to pull that off, really. I kind of like Dio and Jotaro being able to like combo into their like ults because it kind of makes it easier to pull it off because like some of them you gotta like be careful and try and set up like ahead of time kind of like uh, Kosaku you gotta make sure like these guys are absolutely as close as they can get before you activate it, because if not, you're just gonna be standing there, kind of vulnerable. So if they're able to like sidestep it, you're kind of screwed. Oh, that was one of my defensive hits. I thought I was gonna be using an assault one. I like, I like. Ah, shit! I thought jumping over her would take care of that. Yeah, now see? Like, imagine her as a Haman user. Holy shit, that causes a lot of damage. Like, Jesus Christ. She really needs to go down, like, quickly. Maybe I need to play as like part four characters like for the mission, like maybe that's part of it. I would not be surprised really. Damn it. I thought I was able to like catch her into that. Uh, for you guys watching, welcome to Crash Couch. My name is HR. And I thought I'd play some more like online matches on JoJo's Bizarre Adventure All-Star Battle Art. And like I am happy, like this is probably the most fun I've ever really had playing an online game. Probably because I'm such a big fan of like the franchise. Like I bought like all the manga that I bought like most of the manga that's currently out right now. And I'm easily gonna add like more to my collection like the, when it comes available. Damn it. I'll blink, I'll blink, I'll blink, I'll blink. Can I block this one? Can I block this one? Yes, I can. That was way too close. That would have been bad if I, uh... Oh yeah, I forgot she's got that mechanic where she comes back. Yeah, she comes back with like white hair. Yeah, her and Bruno, I think, are the only ones that can come back from, like, the dead after you, like, get into, like, the second match. Or, like, it's, like, the final match when you're supposed to determine the victor. Like, they're spinning back kick, that's nice. I always kind of like that move with Dio, where he just looks like he's being so fucking lazy, just like, ugh. Let's switch it up. Let's play as uh, Josuke. And let's go with Okiyasu for the assist. And if you guys want to check out some of my uh, other JoJo streams, I have them uploaded to my YouTube channel. Uh, YouTube.com slash Crash Couch. 
I also have like a Twitter account that I've been trying to use more because uh, I need to get used to posting updates and whatnot on there. Because uh, I need more experience when it comes to social media. But no, I have like everything from like Injustice to uh, Saints Row and like, also, like even Spider-Man, so I'm sure you guys will find something you'll like up there. After all, Koichi won't even look at me. Well, I'm pretty sure that also has to deal with the fact that you fucking kidnapped him. Wait, how did she already activate Love Deluxe? Is it because she has Koichi as an assist? Crazy Tayabundo! And if you guys like, feel free to go ahead and start talking in the chat. Just keep it civil. And uh, no spoilers for the manga or the anime, just in case there are people who aren't caught up yet. And let's all just try and have some fun, guys, because that's the main reason why I started this channel and been working to try and make everybody's days just a little bit better. Oops. I keep forgetting if you hit L2 during a combo. It just cancels it instead of like doing a throw. Man, I sent that bitch flying. I love Okiyasu. He's probably like one of my favorite like Joe Bros in the entire show. Like, he's such a, a fierce, loyal, good friend, but he's also got, like, the emo like uh, the intelligence of Kronk. Like, he is an absolute fucking moron, and I love him for it. Hopefully, I can start... Okay, good. Looks like I had a bit of my momentum going, but then... Alright, good. I managed to get her into my ult. That should level the playing field somewhere. Yeah, Crazy Diamond is like one of the few things that I've seen that's actually able to make Pink like look badass. <laughs> this and like uh, D4C are like some of the only abilities that I've ever seen in any form of media that makes Pink look intimidating. Crazy Diamond also just like like one of my favorite designs in general. It just looks... it kind of reminds me of like a Roman gladiator in a way. Where it's like it's helmet and it like gets select like armor piece. Uh, armor... Fucking hell I can't English! Armor pieces! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Just beast this shit out of her. It's like, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize uh, I messed up. Later, have a good one. <laughs> Probably just healed her with like crazy diamond first, and then I was like, yeah, sorry about that. No, not anymore. Because I guess he, I guess Beauty managed to tame the beast. Because now she's, I guess, a lot less crazy than she used to be. I wonder if that's like a trap in the ground that I did, or... I'm not entirely sure. Okay, he's pretty good at like keeping like distance, playing like like peekaboo and whatnot. I guess that is supposed to be a trap, but I don't really know how to activate it because that's the longest I think I've ever seen like damage stay on like a stage before. Crazy Diamond! 
If I heal you, then it's not exactly cheating now, is it? God, I love this game so much. <laughs> Beat the shit out of a girl. Oh man, this feels awesome now, doesn't it? And I think that move where he... I think that move where he does like the uh, kick from like the downward position, I think that was from like his final battle with like Yoshikage Kira. Because uh, during that battle, like he gets his like legs swept out from under him and then de delivers like a devastating kick that like Killer Queen's face, it was pretty sick. Oh, that's a pretty cool pose right there. And he's about to get right back up, because that's what Yukako can do whenever she gets like taken out for the second time. Why is he just letting me hit him like that? Is that for like the online missions? Man, that, that, I love that punch right there. Cause it looks like he's just impaling them on like crazy diamond's fists and it just looks so cool. I want to play as Okiyasu now, so let's see if, uh, let's see if Pickle wants to do like another match. find our next match. Alright. Well, I go creator 200. Yeah. I love the difference between our two Jotaros. Like, mine is more like this angry, feral berserker. And then, uh... He's just more calm, just like, yeah, I'm gonna have to kick your ass, but uh, don't worry about it. Oh, really? You can d you can double up on uh, on like the main character and the assist. That's kind of interesting. This is the gold experience. Okay, this guy's pretty good at keeping the distance, so I'm gonna have to try and keep the pressure up on him. This Okiyasu is like definitely a close range fighter. Fucking hell! Yeah, I can't exactly block that technique, because trust me, I've tried before. It never fucking works. Christ, back off me! Okay, well played, Lego Creator. That was a close one. Yeah, 
need to try and build up some momentum and just keep it going because I can't exactly... Okay, man, I... He is really good at uh, playing Oak or playing as Jorno, like, Jesus Christ. God damn it! I thought since I got him in the combo, like, I'd be able to keep him there. Ah, uh, well put. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. Get up, get up. Oh, well played. Well played. Set up the regular heat to be able to transfer right into his great heat attack. And now he's kicking my ass and pulling his- oh. Well fucking played, my good sir. Well played indeed. Okay, yeah. Yeah, well fucking played, like Jesus Christ. You know what? You kind of got me in a part 5 mood now. Let's try, uh... Let's try Bruno with, uh, Giorno as the assist. Oh, Cairo Bridge! That's probably, like, my favorite map in this game. I, I don't know, I guess I just really like kind of, like, how simple and clean it is. Like, there's not a lot, like, uh, trying to crowd into it. Trying to take up like like space and whatnot. Fucking hell! Okay, this guy is really good at changing combos together. Fucking Christ! Back the fuck off, son! Like, holy shit, like, I barely even managed to get any hits at all on him. Hopefully I can change that pretty soon, but... Hopefully I can pull off, like, my ult. Fuck. Oh yes, I managed to get him! surprised there aren't more stands that have like battle cries. Like the only two outside of like Jorno and part 5. Actually no 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 no. Actually no part 5 kind of has the most because there's like Gujarati with like uh Adi Adi and then like a uh, Narancha with Bola Bola and then Purple Haze who has like Uba Shots and then like Spice Girl has like Wannabe. Ah, oh, damn, that's what I was gonna try and do to you. Well played. Wait, how do you block me trying to grab and throw you? Uh, huh. I thought he was able to catch me in that combo. I like when you call them, like, call characters in from, like, the same part. Like, they'll actually talk to each other. Like, like when I summoned Jorno for the assist, I heard him go, like, Bujarati! <laughs> oh shit, I'm out of it. Okay, we're both out of assist, so now at this moment, it's like, who can hit who first in this combo? Well played, Lego Creator. That was a good one. 
I actually had a lot of fun with that one. Good thing you're an idiot. Hey, I'm not Okiyasu, alright? I'm not that fucking stupid. Alright. Hopefully I can do better in this round. Managed to get the first... Managed to get the first attack off, so that's good. Need to keep, you need to get some momentum going. Okay, he's pretty good as Josuke. I might need to switch back to Jotaro or Dio to try and stand a chance against him. It's like, he is really good at pulling off like these combos. Like, Jesus Christ. Holy shit. This guy is doing like fighting game classes. I really need to. Uh, no problem. Like, like it's easy, especially when you're having a lot of fun with the games you're playing. So that's probably what I would recommend for looking for a streamer. Is like, how much fun are they having with their game? Because if they're having a lot of fun. Then that makes the stream more enjoyable for them, and then makes them a better entertainer for you guys. And, like, that's one reason why I keep coming back to this game, is just, like, I have so much fun with it. Like, I have a hell of a headache right now, but that's not because of this game, it's just because of my bad sleeping habits. So, uh, thank you very much for the compliment, um, or, or, or unlimited? Hopefully I'm saying that correctly. I apologize if I am saying it wrong. But yeah, welcome to Crash Couch. My name is HR and I'm glad you're having a lot of fun here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Fuck, 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 fuck! No, 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 no! Ah! Fuck me, I lost this one! Oh, oh shit! I forgot. I forgot. Me too. I think can do that. No, no. Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up. Ah! But yeah, no. If you're into JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, like this is the game for you. Like this is definitely a game for JoJo fans. It is just so good. Like, if this game were to get brought to EVO, I would start watching those again. I watched them for a bit, but then I stopped. But no, if they were to bring this game to, like, EVO, I would, I would watch the absolute shit out of it. And do my best to try and learn as much as I could. Ooh, Mista main. Okay, that's interesting. I would probably have a hell of a hard time against you, Aura, because, like, as you can see, like, I'm a melee kind of main, like Jotaro or Dio, and so I don't exactly have any good uh, options for ranged fighters, or I guess any good options to fight against them. Aw, oh, man. Looks like you're having a bad internet connection. Hopefully this doesn't last for too long, because... I want to keep on going. I fucking love this game. But no, Mista... Ah, damn it! Mista is probably one of my favorite characters from Far 5. And I don't think they ever fully explain... Where said any range? Hmm. You know what? I guess I might give him a try then. I have never really played as him before, but... Oh boy. This is not gonna work out well for me. This guy has a lot of fucking wins. But you know what? I said I would, Aura, or Aura, Aura Limited. So I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna play as Mista. This is gonna fucking hurt. Uh, let's see here. Uh, 
Ah, shit, he's a complicated character. Fuck. I don't have that much experience. With, I'm not that good when it comes to, like, fighting games, so this is going to be interesting. And uh, if you're enjoying this so far, Aura Limited, I do have more videos of this on my uh, YouTube channel. YouTube.com slash Crash Couch. And I also have, like, uh, me playing through, like, a uh, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, like, Eyes of Heaven. Fuck you. Oh boy. I am not doing a very good job of this so far. Oh shit, was that one move? No, he... Yeah, he's got one move. Oh, did he turn out stage hazards? Or are stage hazards not available for online? Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, Aura Unlimited, thank you for the follow. Welcome to Crash Couch. Come on, six pistols! Fuck him up, boy! Uh, never mind. I, uh. Man, he says, like, one of my favorite characters from Part 5, but holy shit, I am doing a piss poor job of showing him off right now. And I've been used my defensive kit for, like, White Album, so I only, only got his attack ones left. Focus, focus. Almost got him. Huh. Uh, I'm kind of on an adrenaline high right now. Been having so much fun with this game. I'm getting way too into it, but I don't really care because that's like the best way to get into a game. Run. Almost got him. Almost got him round in. Apologies, Aura Limited. I am definitely a lot of Mr. Main. Need three sex pistols in order to combo. Gotta watch your. Yeah, because if you get like a. Because if you end up like with like four bullets, you lose some of your like a uh, heat gauge. Okay. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'll do one more match with him and let's go with uh uh let's see here. Let's go with Fugo. <laughs> All right, thank you for the advice, Aura Limited. I'm gonna try and uh, load as many sex pistols as I can right away in order to try and capitalize on that. to let me back up and like get some more in. Down, 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 medium. Down, down, heavy for quick reload. Come on. 
for an attack assist because I failed to see like how he's like a trap. Okay. Now that I learn now that I know that uh, tidbit okay, Missa is a lot better than I originally thought he was. Oh man, that was almost like a complete wipe right there. Fuck, 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 fuck. Come on, Mesa. Come on, come on, come on. I really wish there was a way to get out of the combos, because it doesn't really seem to be that kind of mechanic yet. It seems like once you get hit with a combo, you're kind of stuck in it. Not gonna fall out. Not, for, not gonna fall for that one, bitch. I say as I automatically run right into like his grab range. Damn it! I thought I had him in the combo. I wonder if grabs count for this. Oh shit! They don't. Damn it, I thought I was... Uh, I thought I had blocked him. Yeah. Okay, now... Now I'm starting to get the... Okay, now I got missed a little bit. Kinda interested to... See how well you play him. Well, thanks for the advice, Or Unlimited. If it wasn't for that, I probably would have still been playing Mista the wrong way. Let's play some Fugo, actually. And let's go with, uh, let's see here. Let's go with Yoshi Kage for the assist. No, I, I completely forgot about that mechanic from Mista, so... If it weren't for you, I'd probably still be pulling the same crap over and over again. He turned traitor again. Purple <laughs> Hazel! other villains had like battle cries as well because I would kind of be interested to see what Diabolos is. <laughs> Who's your favorite villain from JoJo or Unlimited? For me it's probably Dio. Like he's my all-time like favorite villain. Like Wamu is probably like a close second. Oh well played. I need to learn how to use my assist, uh, I need to learn how to use my assist better. Cause like, he's using them like a, in a, in a best way possible to extend his combos. But yeah, no, if you guys are coming for like, fighting advice, do not, uh, do not come to me for like, fighting game, like, mechanics or advice. 
If you want to watch an idiot scream at the top of his lungs while getting his ass kicked, I got you. But I am no, like, expert in the slightest, so I would not come watching me for that. Unless you want to see, like, what not to do. Because I can definitely help you out with that one. Damn it! I guess he's I guess he's one of them that you can't combo into. Oh, I almost got him. Is Dio? I am not part. For some reason, I've been real hesitant for starting part 6 yet. I should probably watch some before going to bed. Because I want to see, like, how Poochie is. But no, I, I agree, like, Dio, like, Dio is just a really good one. And since Poochie is probably his most loyal and fanatical devotee outside of Vanilla Ice, I'm kind of curious to see how, like, he's portrayed in, like, the anime. I need to start collecting, like, the manga as well again. Because, um, they started re-releasing the manga with, like, new covers and whatnot, and some, like, extra, like, behind-the-scenes stuff from Meraki san And so once they start releasing that for, like, parts 4 through 6, I'll start collecting them again. But I noticed on the Viz manga app, they have, a uh, They have, like, a... They started releasing, like, the weekly chapters for, like, part 6, so... I should probably start reading that. Because I don't really have much of an excuse not to, really. I've just been stuck on, like, a romance, like, manga binge recently. I know that probably sounds strange, a guy saying he reads romance manga, but... I'm not exactly like most guys in general. Like, I have no trouble reading those, like, they're probably some of my favorite stories in general. Why is being considered- why is being called brazen an insult? I'm pretty sure that just means, like, open. I think I might do, like, one more match as, like, Fugo, and then switch it up to being, like, a uh, Trish. Because Spice Girls is like one of my favorite stands from Part 5 and Spice Girls never really got a lot of love. And she had like one fight against like Notorious B.I.G. And then just kind of got shoved away to the background. Kind of makes you wonder like why she was even introduced to the Gimlet, really. Oops. Yeah, I would definitely say so, because JoJo is like one of the only anime where you can see guys pulling poses off like these. Where most people would probably get called like massive like insults for it. And like be comfortable with it. Because like I've been wanting to cosplay Dio for like a long time. And once I can lose some more weight, I probably will. Currently around like uh, 266, so I could definitely stand to lose a couple pounds here and there, but I don't think I'll ever get like a like six pack like area. And also, I'm not one to judge in general. So if you tell me you're a girl that likes uh, romance or uh, like uh, action, like bloody like Satan manga, good for you. You're a guy that enjoys watching, like, watching romance manga or anime like Fruit Basket and whatnot? Good on ya. As long as you ain't hurt nobody, I don't really care what you do or what you enjoy. In fact, I might even check out some of the stuff you guys recommend. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh sweet, I actually managed to pull it off. Jesus Christ, that, that's horrifying. Yeah, 
exactly. That's a good way to look at it, Aura Limited. Life, life offers endless possibilities. So yeah, there really is no reason to limit yourself. Oh boy, oh boy. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Yeah, I'm thinking like part part three deal probably has like my favorite design. So I would wanna like cosplay him. That shit kinda gear would also be kinda fun to do as well. Like Killer Queen is probably like one of my favorite stands. Like one of my favorite villain stands. So like even cos like even cosplaying a stand would be kind of fun. So long as I can have like a partner who would like cosplay like the stand user. Alright, let's go for Trish. Oh shit, vanilla ice. Oh man, that's gonna be you can't block any of his attacks, so this is going to be interesting. Who would you want to cosplay as, Or? Like, out of, like any of the JoJo characters, like hero or villain, who would you want to do? Fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, Vanilla Ice is pretty broken. He is like hella fast. Yeah, there... Oh man, this guy is really good at Vanilla Ice. I barely even scratched him. I... yeah... There is no way that I was going to be able to get out of that one to victory. Get up, get up, get up. Get up, get up, get up. Well, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Like, I got a friend that's, uh... I got a friend that's, like, African-Canadian and... Like, she would cosplay as Cocky Oin. So you don't necessarily have to... You don't necessarily have to, like, let your skin color determine, like, who you are. Or, like, who you can cosplay as. Because, like, Yoshikage Kira is, like, Japanese and I'm white. So some people probably would give me shit about my race for that, but... No, it, it's just like, I love this character, I want to dress up as this character. It doesn't matter what he is. Because I can guarantee you that there are black cosplayers that will, like, cosplay as, like, Captain Marvel or, like, Tony Stark. So it doesn't really matter who you are or what you are. It just matters about your passion for the character. That's the only thing that really should matter. Ooh, Prosciutto and Pesci. I keep forgetting they're even in this game. But no, yeah, like I said, I got a black friend that cosplays as Cock- that cosplayed as Cock Yoin. Cock Yoin's Japanese, so... And nobody gave her shit over that. As long as you're enjoying it, that's the important thing. I probably rambled on for a bit too much for there, but I hope my point came across well. Oh, okay, that's what you meant. Yeah, no, I... Uh, I'm, I'm afraid I, I probably won't ever be able to understand fully, but... I do understand, yeah, you, it does It does probably make you feel really good when you're represented properly. Sorry that I, sorry that I misunderstood you there. Yeah, Abdul and, uh, 
I think Coco Loco. Then there's like Smokey. Oh boy. Going straight to hell. Yeah, that's basically what I was trying to... Oh, thanks a lot. That's what I was just trying to come across, so it doesn't really matter who you are or what you are. In fact, that might, like, it might even be fun to do, like, a... Like, think of, like, a gender fan cosplay for, like, Trish. Oh, that would be fun. Like, I would totally... If you, if you were to ever, like, meet in person, I would totally do, like, Narancha. And join in and do, like, the torture dance, because that would be, like, a lot of fun to do for, like, a, like, a TikTok video. Fight, fight. And I think, like, the torture dance is, like, what, one or two panels in the manga? But then, like, the anime, they expanded it into, like, a full-on, like, music video. Which I always thought was really cool. It just, like, blew my mind, kind of, like, seeing that in action. <laughs> Oh, oh, fight, 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 fight! Are you that there, G? Yeah, no, like, I went to my first Comic Con last month. Right around the time of, uh, like, the Dragon Ball movie coming out. And I was talking to my friends that went with me, and we were agreeing that we should all do, like, a group cosplay next year. Oh, well. GGD, man. I hope you have a good day. Alright, let's go ahead and find our next matchup. Yeah! Evidently, Trish is not too bad. I just need to get a little more practice in with her, so... Caesar! Let's play some more Trish, and let's go for, uh... Let's go for Naranja as the assist. Like, I kinda wanna see, like, I don't know, like, Trish go up against, like, Diavolo, or... Like, she didn't really get a lot of, like, love in the series. She only had, like, the one fight. Well, yeah, thanks for talking to me, Aura Limited. Hope you have some more fun with this. Don't feel pressured or anything to talk to me. I was just having fun with the little. I had fun with the conversation we did have, so. Have a good one. Persistence? Perkissus? How the fuck do you even pronounce that? Like, Jesus Christ. Wait, am I the one having bad internet? Is that why that symbol is above my head? I guess that makes sense, because... Man, I need to talk to my roommates about getting, like, better internet. maybe get another I currently have like one roommate but I should probably see if I can oh uh, well played well fucking played ah uh, that's an instant win well fucking played 
And I don't know if Purple Haze feedback is in the, uh, is canon or not, but if it is, evidently after the events of Part 5, Trish becomes like a highly successful, like, pop star. Oh, nice! I managed to pull it off! I didn't think I actually hit him with it. What are you about to do? What? Like, I kind of wish by hitting, like, L2 you can, like, break out other combos because, like, once he hit me, like, there's no way out of that for me. Kind of frustrating. Hey, that's Joe Throw's line, asshole. Gonna fucking sue you for copyright infringement, bitch. Let's go ahead and have a rematch. and it's fucking whole horse. Okay, I guess Trish is better as a fighter with her stand out as opposed to like uh, like other characters who can like mix it up with like the human and like stand abilities. Fuck, 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 fuck. I am not gonna win this one. I am not gonna win this fight at all unless I can somehow pull off like a miracle like right here Because I don't think this is gonna kill him right here Not a bad not a bad damage output, but uh I got cocky and I tried to grab him right there. I figured he would have tried to go for like a block or something, so I didn't. Ah, Spice Girl has pretty good damage output. I guess the Arancha is anti here as an assist. I thought he was just gonna shoot in like a straight line. Fuck! God damn it! Okay, I need to. Okay, okay, okay. Fuck! There is no way in hell I'm gonna win this one. Nope, no fucking way in hell. Like this guy can blink and I'm dead. Let's go back to character select. I need to go back to Jotaro. Jotaro, and let's do Trish as the assist. Oh, there we go. Oh, Narancha with Dio as part one Dio as the assist. Okay, that's interesting. played as Narancia, or if I have, I didn't do it for very long. I should probably give him another chance too, but... What?! Fuck you, internet! Man, I hope that doesn't reflect badly on my online record, because 
I wasn't trying to rage quit or anything. I guess the internet connection just got lost. Oh shit, I accidentally hit circle. Alright. <laughs> I'm a fucking dumbass, man. I hit the wrong button. Yeah, for those of you guys who are watching, welcome to Crash Couch. My name is HR, and I'm hoping you guys are liking what you're seeing. Like, this game is like a hell of a lot of fun, and probably the most fun I've had online with uh, video games in general. I've never been much of an online player, but this game is definitely like making me change my perspective on that. Especially since I had to play like a hundred online matches to get the trophy. Which I did succeed in platting the game by the way. Like I do have the platinum trophy for All-Star Battle R. Took me a while to get it though. Cause I also had to buy like 500 items from like the in-game shop. Using like the gold you got from the fights and... Woo! I had to buy a bunch of shit to get this. But I would definitely say it's worth it. Cause I got the platinum dub, baby! Kinda surprised I haven't found anybody else yet. Let's, let's try backing up and then walking, let's go back in. Maybe that'll help. Okay, looks like we might have somebody. There we go. I almost thought that was the same guy from earlier because I saw Caesar. Alright. And uh let's see here, let's let's play his Dio with the uh Let's go father and son. Let's let's play that tag team. And I heard and it looks like he's picking Yoshikage Kira, so this should be fun. Yoshikage Kira with Jotaro. Oh nice. That should be a fun matchup. Yeah, no, this is definitely a game for JoJo fans, so if you guys are in any way interested in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, I would highly recommend this game. Like, it's fan-fucking-tastic. Outside of the online, which they could probably fix, which they probably fix later if they add, like, a roll- like, a rollback netcode. Like, the only- the only complaints I have outside of, I guess, the online disconnecting a lot is, uh, I wish it was like a 2v2 like tag team instead of just like 1v1 with an assist. Considering they reworked it from the ground up, like they probably could have done that. But outside of that, I I have like no complaints at all about this. And if you guys are liking what you're seeing, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. Uh, YouTube.com slash Crash Couch. Like I have a bunch of these JoJo streams up on there. And uh, I'm planning to do like a separate like thing for online like, or for online streams or for fighting games in general. So like I'm gonna be starting like a playlist for like online matches. I have this. I have Eyes of Heaven, the Injustice game story modes, 
and uh, Spider-Man. Like, I just got through that and the DLC, so that was a lot of fun as well. And it's kind of a little cheesy, but I was calling those, like, the webisodes. So it's like Spider-Man, like, webisode one. I wanted to originally wait for, like, the release date of the second game so I could play them leading up to it. But eventually I kind of got, you know, just tired of waiting. So I just went, you know, fuck it and... Uh, just started going through them and... Those games are amazing. I would definitely recommend those to anybody who has never played, like, the uh, Insomniac, like, Spider-Man games. Alright. Managed to find a new uh, challenger. Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, hopefully they accept. What an outstanding noodle! Doesn't fall for mind games. I guess that's technically true because Dio took control of you with a flesh blood. He wasn't. He didn't exactly play a mind game on you so long as. Uh, so much as he just. Uh, let's see here. Giorno or Butarazzi? Let's go with Giorno. He didn't exactly, like, play a mind game on you so much as he literally took possession of your body and was remote controlling you. Oh shit, it's me. Uh, let's see. Oh, sweet, the train station. I really enjoy that. That's a good map. Like, I don't really think there's a stage on here that I don't like. <laughs> and what was that you were saying about me not getting close to you? Cause here I am up in your grill, man. Gotta steal your girl. I don't even know what the fuck I'm saying. Oh, well, it looks like the stage hazard is up and ready. Fuck! Shit. Yeah, no, this, uh, I never get tired of playing this game, man. I'm thinking about doing, like, a, like, a segment for Fridays where I play, like, different fighting games. Hopefully I can survive this one. Stop fucking him! Fuck! That would've been awesome if I could've caught him in, in there. No, come on, come on, come on. Holy shit, how the fuck did I pull that one off? Like, Jesus Christ, I should have lost that fight. I kind of, I do kind of wish that sometimes the controllers were a little bit easier to pull off because I know you can use, like, Starfinger. But because it's like in a Z like type pattern that you have to move like the controller stick in, I don't really think I'm gonna be able to do that very often. Because I am not an expert when it comes to like fighting games. Stop fucking up! Alright! Managed to pull it up this time! What's y'all's favorite, like, uh, battle cry? Oda Oda is pretty good, but I also kind of like Muda Muda. Because it's basically just calling your opponent and everything they're doing useless. Yep, you're screwed, man. With the way the camera is, there is no way you could have avoided that. Great A, not bad. Can't remember the last time I ever had an A for any of my grades, so nice to see that again. 
disconnected. Well, let's try, let's try one more time. Because I want to keep on going, because I am having like way too much fun with this game. And if you guys are liking what you're seeing here, be sure to leave a follow here. And if you like, go ahead and start feel free to start talking in chat. Just remember to keep it civil and uh, no spoilers for the manga or the anime. Like we're all just here to have some fun, so let's just try and keep it fun for everybody, all right? Okay. Looks like we might have somebody. I'm not entirely sure just yet. Here we go. I won't cry over burying you. Yeah, he said that against Dio, if I remember correctly. Let's go with Dio. Speaking of, let's go with Dio. And, uh, Yoshikage Kiyana. And, uh, let's... Actually, you know what? Let's go to the Cairo Bridge. It's like my favorite map here. If they ever decide to do DLC stages for All-Star Battle R, I would totally buy them. It's like there's so much potential that they could do. Like they could do like the um, island that Joseph and Caesar trained on during the events of Part 2. They could have, also have like Hell Climb Pillar as a, uh, as a stage. Like Death 13's role from Part 3. Let's see here, from part four, they could probably have like that, uh, they can't have like the Nijimura household. Shit, shit. Okay, this guy is pretty good as Josuke. Either that or I've been too distracted thinking of the DLC stages. Yeah, from Car 5, they could probably have like the plane where they fought like Notorious B.I.G. Car 6, they could do like the Kennedy Space Center. Ah, uh, fuck me. Ooh, this guy is pretty good as Josuke. Monkler 1? I think that was Monkler? Not bad. You're doing pretty good. I'm definitely going to be calling a rematch against you because I refuse to lose this Dio. Because it would leave like a bad taste in my soul. <laughs> Oh shit, it really is me with a bad internet connection. Well, I guess that's as good a time as any to call it for today, so... Thank you guys for coming on back to Crash Couch. My name is HR, and I'll see you guys Monday. Now, unfortunately, I am working this whole weekend, so this is going to be the last stream for today. But I'll see you guys again Monday with some more, like, Spider-Man Miles Morales. In the meantime, let's see who we can give a raid to. Oh, it looks like my friend Cell Kitten is up, so let's go ahead and give her some love. She's playing, like, a Pokemon Sword and Shield. In the meantime, I hope you guys have a good one, and I'll see you guys later.